What is going on YouTube? My name is Keys, or you can call me Thy Keys, and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to fix the OBS Studios black screen of death issue. I've noticed it's been going around on, like around laptops. I don't know why. Maybe desktops too, but I haven't seen any like issues with desktops. But without further ado, let's get into this video. What you want to do is click the Windows Start menu right here. Settings. System. Display. You want to scroll all the way down until you see graphic settings. Once you're here, make sure this is selected the classic app. You want to hit browse. Now you want to find where the OBS Studios is installed. So you hit the C drive right here. Program files. OBS Studio. Bin. 64 bit. And it'll be right here. Now I'm not going to add it, but what you want to do, you want to click add. I'm going to cancel. And right here, I'm gonna click it. Options. Make sure it's on power saving. Now, for you, it might work on high performance, but for me, it works on power saving, so I'm gonna leave it as is. Once you do that, hit save. We're gonna close from this. Now we're going back into a directory. So you wanna hit go to go to your um, files, this PC, the C drive, program files, OBS Studio, bin. 64 bit again Just go all the way down until you see this file right here I'm gonna right click properties compatibility now right here make sure this one this this ticked and make sure this is ticked and right here for the drop down menu select Windows 7 applied oh and then okay now what then once you do that want to right click on your home screen and then until you find the video control panel now for you if you have an AMD system your, yours might say AMD control panel or it might say radio control panel you want to click it give it some time I also like to thank you guys for 5,000 subscribers that really means a lot to me and once you once it's open go down to manage 3d settings global settings make sure it's selected to auto select then you want to go over to program settings and now since you're doing this the first time you won't see OBS studio so what you have to do you have to add do the same thing as before browse the C drive program files OBS studio bin 64 bit and then right it'll be right here oh, oops I accidentally opened it it'll be right here now what you want to do is cancel well for me no you don't you don't want to cancel <laughs> what you want to do is open for me I'm gonna cancel since you already saw this there so once it's there you'll see it right here you want to make sure this is ticked right here then this drop down menu make sure you select integrated graphics and then if you wanted to and then I'm gonna show you if you want to record gameplay as well but for now you want to hit integrated graphics and it's gonna say apply you gotta wait a little bit, then you exit from, exit from this. Now, if you wanna do gameplay, you're gonna do the same thing. Control panel. Give it some time, because it always takes like, a while to load. Program settings. And then for gameplay, put it on high performance. High performance. Now, if you guys like this video and hit apply, then you, then, then you know <laughs> you know what to do. So, if you guys like this video, hit that like and that subscribe button. Also, comment down below if this works for you. Comment and then also comment down below if it doesn't work for you. I'll try to help as much people as I can. Thank you guys for watching this. Thank yet again. And roll to 10K. Here we come. <laughs>